up from my window Sun's coming up like the day before You're like a stone on my pillow I don't make a sound when I shut the door morning my lovelies welcome back to my channel and welcome to another vlog i'm so excited for today's video like i i feel like i say this all the time but i feel like i'm extra excited because i've got so much that i want to do today and i'm just i'm excited i'm excited i'm excited i hope you guys have got your favorite drink your favorite snacks you're under the blanket and i really hope you are excited for today's video first of all i'm really so like i've put makeup on so you can't see I mean, you might be able to, but my hay fever today, it's like I've woken up and it's the worst it's been in a long time. I knew I jinxed it. Last week I said to Bradley, I literally, like since coming back from the cruise, I haven't had bad hay fever. Why did I say that? It's like come back worse than ever. I take antihistamines before I go to bed and it's like nothing happens. I think I need to go to the doctors and get like a proper, like hardcore prescription because... <laughs> It is horrible, like literally, like so bad. Um, and normally I have to put makeup and stuff on because it helps me not to like touch my face as much. I say that and I've got an itchy nose. And normally it does help, it has helped a lot. But yeah, it's just like itchy. It's, my nose is the itchiest that I just can't. If you guys have any tips for hay fever, please pop them in the comments because I'm going to do everything. <laughs> do everything I can because I cannot I just can't but how are you all doing please let me know in the comments down below I love to like chat with you guys in the comments it's honestly one of my favorite things when you guys take the time to comment I just love it it's just so sweet so in today's video I've got a couple of home stuff I've got a couple of packages downstairs um Ikea being one of them I went to next yesterday which was amazing so I've got some like home stuff that I want to do I want to put like a mirror up and some DIY bits that I want to do and also later Bradley agreed to go to B&M we didn't know it closes at nine in the week did any of you know that <laughs> I just I don't know why we never looked and he was like Amy it closes at nine like let's just go on Monday I was like okay we were gonna go on Saturday but we were so busy on the weekend that we just wouldn't have had any time and it would have been really rushed and obviously in a weekend it's extra busy he was like if anything they might get more deliveries on monday and it'll be like more relaxing i was like oh. so we're gonna go there and in the same complex there's also a tk max and i did kind of say to him like should we look in there to see if we've got any autumn candles he was like okay fine we can have a look so i was like oh, boyfriend points at the moment at the past few times i've had to go by myself but it's just so much more fun going with someone. So I'm really excited about that. So yeah, I'm really excited for today just to spend the day together and have a nice like chill day at home and then go out, which will be really lovely as well in a little bit. I've also got an exciting delivery. I feel like I always have an exciting delivery, but this is a delivery from a brand called Teddy Blake. And I have something so exciting in here to show you. This will give it away. Um, and I'm going to unbox it with you guys literally in a little bit. I want to put up a couple of bits around the house first and then I want to get ready into a nice outfit and then show you guys the bag that I have from Teddy Blake. Um, they've also really kindly partly sponsored today's video. Do you know what? Teddy Blake was the first, and I'm not just saying this, they were the first company, or one of the first, or maybe the second, the second company when I first started off with YouTube and stuff to ever send me something. So I've still got the bag that they sent and it's the most amazing bag and the fact that they were like, we want to work with you again, I was like, oh my god. I'm so excited to show you guys this bag because I think this is like the bag the bag to get. I want to do a couple of DIY bits first and then I'll come up here and show you guys. I've literally just sneezed about 10 times in a row. Honestly, it's so annoying. This is my comfy outfit of the day just to lounge around in for a little bit. Um, I bought these yesterday from Tesco's and they're really nice trousers. They're the softest material ever um, and I've got this bodysuit on from Primark and then I've just chucked on um a dressing gown but yeah super comfy for now and then and then when i show you guys the bag obviously i'm gonna get changed and then we'll be ready to go to the shop stage one so if you guys have been watching my previous videos i swear my hair is getting worse <laughs> um then you will know that i said to you in them videos that i was going to show you the final hallway reveal with the round mirror up 
and Bradley kindly put it up for me and I want to show you. So first of all, ignore this. This is some stuff that I've ordered from Ikea, which is things that I want to put up today. But look how much better that looks. How annoying is that, by the way? This is literally so frustrating, but <laughs> I mean, it controls our heating, so I guess it has to stay. I just don't get why it's in such an awkward place, but hey-ho. Yeah, this is the round mirror that I was talking to you guys about. Um, it looks so much better than the other mirror, or mirrors, because they were kind of like... I bought like frames from Ikea and mirrors and put them in it, um, but I'm just loving it. I have bought a lamp and I think it's coming today, I think. I'm hoping so. So I'm hoping to put the lamp here, hopefully today, um, and see what it looks like, but I just love it. This mirror, by the way, is from Danelm. I think it was £55. It's like the bigger one, but so much better, so much better. And then we've got all of this stuff over here still. Um, ignore the washing there. And there this mirror here is gonna go on this wall so as you can see this wall is bare we used to have this mirror there this one and um, but we are I think we're just gonna sell that one and put this one up instead this one is smaller that is the only thing it is like not the length of it but the width of it is smaller so I mean I'm hoping it'll still look nice I'm gonna pop it up and like see but yeah um, that one is going to go there. So I'm going to pop that one up now. Um, and hopefully it looks really lovely. And then I want to build some of these. These are just going to go behind the door. Um, in the front room in there. This is the Ikea Kallax. They're not drawers. But they're like the kind of like cupboard things. And then I'm going to put these baskets in it. Um, so yeah. The mirror is up. I love it so much. It's so cute. And what I'm going to do is get like little, I don't know what they're called. They're like wall lights to go either side, I think. I think I'm going to order some on Amazon. But I really like it. Like really like it. This is what it looks like as you walk in. I just love it. It's so much better than the other one. Um, but I'm going to build the Kallax drawer cupboard things whatever they're called um, and they're gonna go in here basically <laughs> we've had this since we moved in and that's our foldable treadmill um they're just I just don't like them anymore and I wanted something a little bit bigger that fits more in um like look at that that's like the dog's winter stuff um so yeah I'm gonna organize this and then replace it with those that was until I found you. Okay, so I've built the Kallax drawers and I actually really like it as like a little coffee table kind of thing next to the sofa. Um, the other marble table is here. This is our usual like side coffee table, which I've just put there for now. Um, and our treadmill was here. It fell earlier and I was so scared, but it's fine now. Um, behind the door, I just put my laptop in and the charger and then the cable to the treadmill um, but I really like it I did have it here but I actually wanted it on show and then I was thinking oh if I put like some nice bits on top I love these cards by the way by Roxy Nafusi like they're insane if you've read her book get these because they're amazing and um, so in the top one here I've just put all my like work bits and bobs and then the bottom one I think there's some like nail bits 
and like pampering stuff um, but yeah I really like it I'm really happy with it I've just put that there for now because I don't want to get rid of that table but it's just kind of there it's good to have but it's all coming together I really like the look of it I'm so happy okay so that is all done I have been sweating my nose honestly I don't know why my hay fever is so bad today it's like the worst I feel like it's ever been like my eyes are dripping, my nose is just streaming, it's just horrible. I've closed all the doors though, I've googled like how to help hay fever and it was like close all the windows, close all the doors, so I've done that um, and I'm hoping it's going to start helping. But I've now got to do some like admin bits and bobs and then I'm going to go upstairs, get ready and unbox the exciting Teddy Blake bag and show you which one I went for. I feel like you guys are going to love it and they've given me a discount code so I'm just so excited. Um, but anyway, oh, I'm hot now. So it has been a little bit since I spoke to you guys. Um, I've now just got changed into these trousers, um, this bando top and then this shirt. And I really am so excited to unbox my Teddy Blake bag to wear with it. Um, I also need to brush up my hair. Excuse <laughs> my hay fever still. Usually it's really bad in the mornings and then by the afternoon it's like my body's like okay I'm used to it and it kind of like dies down a little bit but it just hasn't got any better so I'm very sorry if I sound bunged out but ah, I'm so excited. So this is the bag that I've gone for. You can see with Teddy Blake all of their packaging is amazing. Like I've said they have really kindly partly sponsored today's video. They are gorgeous designer handbags made in Italy, luxury leather but without the humongous price tag. I really love how it comes in these dust bags as well. Oh my god this is even better in person. So this is the beautiful Teddy Blake bag that I've gone for. It is called Cairo Duo Vitello 15 inch. I'll pop a direct link to this down below. Honestly, it was so hard to choose because they've got so many incredible bags and I cannot wait to style it with my outfit. As you can see, everything is just absolutely perfect. The design of it, it is such a beautiful high quality bag and literally perfect in my collection so i think we should go into the mirror now and i can show you guys what it looks like on so this is what the beautiful bag looks like on i just think this is a real life dream it's everything that i could want and more in a bag. I also feel like this is the perfect size. I love the handle. I also love the longer strap as well because it is adjustable. You can take it on and off. You can adjust the size um, and I just love the look of it. I feel like I feel like it is just such a beautiful designer bag without the humongous price tag. This is Italian leather. It is made in Italy. They have the most beautiful designs on their website. Like, honestly, there are so many incredible bags to choose from and you can enjoy up to 60% off which is unbelievable. So of course I'm going to pop a link to this bag and obviously the website to Teddy Blake in the description box down below. You can use my code TBAMYROSE30, I'll pop it on screen and also in the description box and you can get an extra $30 off Teddy Blake which is amazing. This bag is just an absolute dream and I'm so happy with it. This is what it looks like up close. You can see, of course they have experienced craftsmanship and it's just beautiful, like you can really tell the whole design and everything. Like the colour of this is a dream. I just love it with the gold hardware. There is so much room inside. I've literally just popped a few things in there. But even the inside of it is like gorgeous suede. It is going to last absolute years. Like I said, the other Teddy Blake bag that I have, I've still got and it lasts the longest time. So this is definitely an essential for me and I think it fits perfectly within my wardrobe. I literally couldn't go better with everything that I have and I wear and I know I'm going to get so many compliments on this bag. So yeah, I really recommend going to the Teddy Blake website and just... Find the perfect style for you because if you're looking for an incredible high quality designer bag without the thousands of dollar price tag, it's made in Italy, it's Italian leather, it's going to fit so perfectly in your collection, then I think that Teddy Blake is the perfect brand for you. I am so happy with this, like 
can you tell <laughs> it's like if i had to design my dream bag i genuinely think it'd be this because it's a little bit of everything that I love. I love the gorgeous tan with the gold hardware and the gold writing and this beautiful fabric that's got speckles of like cream and tan in it as well. Um, and it is so soft and just durable. It is honestly gonna last me absolute years. Um, and the quality is just insane. I'm so happy just to be working with them. And just to welcome this into my handbag collection and just to wear this all the time. You guys know I'm gonna wear this to death. <laughs> <laughs> I'm such a creature of habit like when I first get something I'm like okay I'm gonna wear you for ages but honestly I'm so happy so yeah thank you so much to Teddy Blake for partly sponsoring today's video like I said to you guys you can use my discount code and all the links and stuff I'll pop in the description box down below definitely check them out because even like how it was packaged the box it comes in if you're looking to get some really lovely gift for any occasion this is just perfect um, and me and Bradley are going away literally right at the beginning of September um, on our last holiday this year and of course this is coming with me of course because it's just beautiful um, and I feel like it's like the perfect travel bag so I'm so happy anyway <laughs> I'm gonna take it on its first outing to TK Maxx and B&M because where else would I go <laughs> I cannot wait to wear this all the time. It is the perfect summer bag and they have so many more. Like, let me tell you, it was the hardest thing to choose because I was like, oh, I love that one. Oh, I love that one. I spent so long on that website. Um, so yeah, I think you guys will absolutely love them. Okay, so now I need to wait for Buddy to come home from work and then we're gonna go. And I'm, I'm so excited to show you guys like new in stuff and all that kind of good stuff. Let me know in the comments down below if you love this bag, if you're gonna get it, um, and send me pictures if you do get it because oh, I just, I'm literally obsessed. It's just the best thing working with brands that you genuinely love and like wear and stuff. Do you know what I mean? I love it. Okay, I forgot my hairbrush, so I'm trying to brush my hair with my fingers, but I'm now with this one. Hi. Um, Bradley literally came back home from work and then we've come straight out again. But I think because he found out that it closes at like eight or nine, is it? Well, I think TK Maxx is eight. Yeah. B&M's nine. Yeah. Um, we were like, why don't we just go after work? Because we were gonna go on the weekend. So we're really excited. I cannot wait. Is there anything you wanna get today? Mm, I don't think so. Maybe some protein stuff. Oh yeah, they always do good things like that, don't they? Yeah. They always do like brands that you can't get in your like normal supermarket. Yeah, maybe some random stuff that you don't normally see. That's literally what B&M is though, isn't it? The things that you don't need, <laughs> but then when you see it, you need it. Yeah. Um, oh, maybe we can see if they've got busy people. <laughs> but yeah, we're really excited. Should we go TK Maxx first or be them first? Uh, TK Maxx, just because it closes. I mean, I think we're both will be fine anyway, but oh, yeah, be them closes later, so we might as well do TK okay. Maxx first. Okay, let's do TK Maxx first, then we're going to be them. Can't wait. It's been ages since we've had a trip like this together. Oh. I've had to go solo for so long now. Yeah. But here I am. But here you are. You've made an appearance again. Yeah, I think I need to buy a hairbrush as well, to be honest. I normally have an emergency car hairbrush, but I think I used it <laughs> and then I did put it back and I don't know where it is. So, oh, I hate that. I know it's literally first world problems, but it's just annoying. Do you know, do you feel what, what I mean? I like, feel your pain. I always forget my brush. I know. Absolute nightmare. Such an annoying thing to forget. But hey ho, at least we're going to TK Maxx and B&M. Maybe they'll have some autumn stuff. Maybe they'll have some gym stuff. <laughs> I thought you were going to be like, autumn? I bought a woven pumpkin yesterday and you were actually really supportive about it. I was. I know it means a lot to you. It does. Oh. Anyway, I think I'm getting in the way. This is the fiddly bit that I don't like when I drive to this B&M by myself. Why? It's all the roundabouts that go into yeah. like different lanes that Those I hate. Lots. But... It is the closest one to us, so. About central. It is. We're going to the Crawley one. Um, maybe we can get dinner out. What maybe. do you want? What do you want? Depends. You're tired, aren't you? <laughs> um, we were just saying though, because obviously we're going to go here and then go back home. Cook dinner just sounds like a lot of effort. And I think I might treat Bradley to dinner out for being such a good boyfriend for coming with me. I am such a good boyfriend. Where should we go for dinner that's round here? The Cineworld's round here. Is it round here? Yeah, kinda. 
I think it's yeah, sort of similar. It's good so we could numbers. do nine days. Should we do nine days? Maybe. Let's have a look at what calories I got. Okay. Okay. See there. <laughs> See there. I was literally filming next and realised we're not going to next. This is the little complex. It's in Crawley. It says next. TK Maxx is there, and then B and M's at the end. So we're going to go to TK Maxx first. I think. Oh, they've also got hobby craft, but. We don't need to get there today, do we? No. <laughs> Brandy's like, no. Basket. Love these scarves. These are where I get all of my... Bit of you, aren't they? They are a bit of me. That one's pretty. It's a cute little purse. Standing underneath the lights Snowflakes are coming down Collapse into water when they hit the ground I hear the sound of empty streets Yesterday has gone to sleep I need honey to make me feel better. Okay, B and M. <laughs> hey guys, we're in B and M. Bradley has to be on the. Oh yeah, good dancing. Oh look, we love our ninety cow ninety <laughs> ninety cow bars. It is empty coming at this time. What's the time? Seven o'clock. Making echoes as we walk. What is it? Sea minerals. Oh my god, that's so nice. That'd be. Is that a fly? Did you see that? I think it's just little bits where you go. Close your eyes and let us fade away. Build a secret place for you and me. Let our minds be caught up. Elsie's boyfriend do this thing all he's dancing but you're shopping with them but he'll like walk off ahead so every time I go near he's like ahead so we're not actually walking together oh here we go oh my god these are so nice for so I can give you jobs then you can tick them off okay or not, or not. <laughs> fresh linen Ooh, what do you think about this one why? He doesn't get it that he needs to be in the video. <laughs> right, what's this one? Wildberry. What's that smell of? Like? No. That noise, by the way, is that. I love this collection. I think it's so nice. Is it? Quite citrusy, isn't it? Mm. I'm a giraffe. Why? You're an elephant. I think these are lovely. Are you burping? <laughs> Look, he's walking, but dancing. <laughs> okay, so 
we finished up in TK Maxx and b and I'm not gonna lie, I don't, like I bought bits, but, sorry, is my hand in your way? Sneeze. It's a bit underwhelming, wasn't it? Is my sneeze gonna come? Um, no, it's fine now. Um, yeah, it was so underwhelming. Like, <laughs> I don't, I think we need to go at like the end of this month just before we go away or even when we come back because it just it was like all their stock was the same from when we last went which was months ago so it wasn't my favorite today but um i did but we picked up a couple of bits and obviously i'll show you guys that when we get home um you got some bits didn't you what did I you did. get then uh, i got a t-shirt and some work shoes he's in a daydream <laughs> yeah. um but yeah, we're now gonna go to Nando's because it's 20 past seven. And then, I don't know, we just kind of... By the time we get home, yeah. we clean. It's just the whole evening gone. And then I think it's like nicer to kind of like enjoy dinner like that. We never planned to eat out, did we? No. We didn't even speak about dinner because we obviously get the weekly foods, but... We're gonna have Nando's today, which is nice and spontaneous. It's weird though, because normally when we go to this Nando's, we go to the cinema after. We're not doing this that today. This time we just go shopping. This time we just go shopping, which is still lovely. It was nice to have a, like, a little look around the shops and stuff, but I mean, there was a lot of like Halloween stuff in TK Maxx, but not all to me, if that makes sense. But she was literally putting it out on the shelf, so I reckon like in a few weeks it'll be like proper but i think when we come back from holiday we'll probably go back to them shops and like have like a nice look around so it was good that i've got a dog bed to go inside here for the dogs as well um but yeah i'll show you guys that when we get home but first stop is nando's how hungry are you I'm so <laughs> hungry. bradley's hungry whenever bradley's hungry he goes quiet because <laughs> so, if i then speak too much i get moody yeah so he's a little bit hungry, but that'll be solved very soon. Take my nice bag. You got a key? This is it. So this is the cinema we usually go to, Cineworld. We've got Cineworld. Oh yeah, there's Hollywood Bowl there. We've been inside it, but we yeah. never we never went in and played. Wagamamas and Nando's here. Standing underneath the lights Look into each other Okay, so we are now home. I literally jumped straight in the shower. Do you know when you've been out and about and you're just like, okay, I need to get in the shower. I've just scrubbed my face um, and my fake tan has completely come off now. <laughs> so I'm looking very pale. But I wanted to show you guys everything you picked up. So in TK Maxx, I think I prefer the Hove one to the one in Crawley. The Crawley one just wasn't that good at all. Um, she was literally putting out all the like Halloween stuff as you would have seen. But there wasn't really any like autumn bits. If you know what I mean. So I think I'm going to go to the Hove one at the end of August. Um, this is for my nephew. It's his birthday on Saturday. So I picked up this little gift bag with dinosaurs on. Which was $1.99. Um, and then I literally got him a card which has Lottie Luna on it. <laughs> and obviously, like, he is obsessed with the dogs. So I just got that. Um, and then <laughs> this is the only, like, autumnal thing I got was this pasta. It was £2.79. And it looks like little pumpkins. And I thought it was really cute. And that was literally everything I got from TK Maxx. Um, Bradley got some shoes and a really nice like, oversized top from B&M. I think this is my favourite thing. How nice is this wreath? It's like a lovely autumnal wreath. Um, it was £10. I'm just, I love it. Like, I really love it. Where's like, oh, it hangs up here. Oh, sort of look like this. I was thinking of putting this on the door in here when I decorate for autumn. So, I love this. It's nice because I think I saw this last year or one similar and I was trying to look for it for so long and I couldn't find it. So I'm so happy I picked up that. Um, the ribbed glasses. I saw them on TikTok and I was like, I need them. 
couldn't find them. I found these ones, which I think, I think the other ones were sold out. These were three pounds each. I literally just bought two. Can you see? They're like ribbed wine glasses. Um, they're still really lovely. I thought like iced coffees in these would be nice or like an alcoholic drink or something or like a Sprite or <laughs> I don't really drink much, but I don't know. I just thought they're really cute. I didn't want to leave them because I thought they're too nice from b &M. These, <laughs> they're only 97 calories each and I have the biggest like sweet tooth, especially when it comes to chocolate. This is for the dogs. Bradley's gonna wanna give it to them, so I'm gonna put that there. Um, I bought these little doorknobs, and they're really like, they're like pearly. I thought they're really lovely in gold. Um, six pound for four. I think I'm gonna put one on my, the drawer in my beauty room, and then the three drawers next to it. I think I'm gonna do that maybe tomorrow. Um, I got two of the Midnight Blooms, the florals. These look amazing, Biscoff cream um, biscuits. And there's like cream in the middle. Me and Bradley have like an obsession with Oreos and like the Fox's cream biscuits at the moment. They're just so nice. Um, I bought some sun cream, this one, because when we go away, it's literally coming up so soon. The end of this month, we go on like the 3rd of September. Um, this looked really lovely. I should have used this in the shower. I've never like, I, I'm a Dove or Nivea kind of person when I shower. I like to smell really clean and fresh, but this one looked really lovely. It's like a foam. Oh, we've got a couple of these white chocolate and cookie dough fulfill bars, protein bars. How nice does that sound? I love white chocolate and I love cookie dough. So we were like, let's get loads of them. Um, we bought this candle. This is going to go in the downstairs bathroom. It smells amazing. It's in the scent sea minerals i think three pounds this smells incredible this is like what i would want all of my bathrooms to smell like even my house but thanks bradley sorry even my house but this is like more of like a fresh bathroom kind of smell um i picked up this fresh unstoppable fabric thing um you and your comfy clothes a kitchen minky cloth um oh and another one of these so that was literally all i bought so i got these which are like the nicest things i'm not a sweet kind of person i'm definitely more of like a chocolate and like biscuit kind of person but they're so nice um but yeah that was it as you can see it wasn't like the most autumnal or successful trip but it just means I'll have to go to the Hove TK Max soon because that one's so much better. Uh, but it was still nice to go. We were saying it, we just had such a nice evening and like going to Nando's for dinner and we went to the Starbucks at Sinuad after. I got my favourite coffee. They grounded it for us um, and it was just really nice at the drive home. Have you had a nice time, Bradley? Yeah, it's been really nice. Thank you. We enjoyed it. You just yeah. had a shower, haven't you? Just had a shower. Now ready to get cosy. We're going to watch an episode of... Virgin River. Virgin River. We love Virgin River. Such a good series, isn't it? Mm. I think we've literally got two episodes left though of the last series. Then we're like, what do we watch after? So write in the comments your favourite series. We like that kind of vibe, don't we? Yeah. Have you turned the telly on? Hmm? It always does that our telly just randomly turns on. The weirdest thing. But um yeah, that is our evening, isn't it? And it our is. day. And I've got hair in my mouth, but I'm going to leave this video here. I've been loving my bag and taking it away with me tonight. It's, it's been really handy and there's loads of like space in it. And I think it's like the perfect size for a bag. I love it. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. Have you got anything you want to say? I do not. You tired? You want to have some mouths? Yeah. I think the doggies missed us. But yeah, thank you for watching. We hope you've enjoyed it. Thank you for spending the day and evening with us. Mm -hmm. And we will see you in next week's video. Anything else? Bye. Well done, Luna. Look at your little belly. Bye. 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 We can spend all day in